So great to see you both. Um, what a you. big show this is going to be. Laura presenting. Thomas, two nominations. Um, how does it feel? I mean, it's cool you guys are doing this together. It's really cool. This is the first time we've ever gotten to do something like this before. Um, you know, we, we usually come to these award shows as you know, husband and wife, and obviously still are, but now Lauren is, is going to be presenting new artist of the year this year, which is pretty awesome. And, uh, you know, I think there was a time in the last month or two, we were just like, man, are the CMA is still going to happen. Is it still going to be a thing? And it's just been amazing to watch how hard they've worked to put such a safe show together. And I'm just honestly itching to hear some live music for the first time this year. So we are very pumped to be here and, and especially doing it together. I love yeah, it. It's an honor. Lore, uh, you wrote, I'm calling you Lore like we're best friends. I, I, I love it. I, I, I love it. I think it's You uh, released a book this year and you're really kind of entering this world. How does it feel to kind of step into the spotlight a little more? It is not my vibe. Um, <laughs> it is, I'm just being full candid here. I just, I knew I was marrying into it with him, but my whole life he has been, in the center of the stage and always entertaining even since we were like in third grade truly and so I'm used to that for him and so I was like yeah we'll just keep doing life like we always have but slowly and surely over the last few years I've kind of inched a little bit closer and gotten a little bit closer and now this year feels like a lot of firsts for me but thankfully I've gotten to do most of them with him and everybody I've been able to work with and meet through book release and writing the book and book tour and, you know, CMA Country Christmas, now CMAs and, and uh, the artist of the year that I got to do. It's all been, the country music community is just the best community in the whole world. And so getting to do a lot of those firsts with this community has been amazing for me to like get my toes wet with all of this. And then having you know, the best teacher in the world that I'm married to helps a lot too. So um, it's, it's been nerve wracking and it's made me a little bit more anxious, but it's been really good. So sweet. Before I let you go, I got to ask you about your three daughters, adorable uh, Halloween costume as the Sanderson sisters. Uh, Thomas, was this your idea? What do you think? <laughs> uh Absolutely. No, we, we, we watch Hocus Pocus a lot during the Halloween holidays. And I want to say after we were watching it one night, Lauren just started to put the pieces together of all these characters in the show. And she was like, well, maybe, maybe the girls can be the Sanderson sisters and you and I can be Max and Allison. And then Tyler Page, our brother-in-law can be ice. And my sister can dress up like, like Jay from the, the graveyard scene. And all of a sudden our Connors, whole, fa Binks and yeah, our whole family Danny. is just I mean, it was, it was characters perfect. from the movie. It was perfect. And my brother was Billy. We cannot forget Billy because yeah. <laughs> he had the most costume to put on and face makeup. And so he, he took one for the team for yeah. sure. I love it. You guys win cutest family Halloween costume. Thank oh, you shoot. so much. I <laughs> Thank know you got you. it. Thank you. All right. Good to see you. Have a good yeah, one. Yeah, you too.